Ah, welcome back, everybody, to this next fall camping adventure. Ah, favorite time of year. Um, we're doing things a little differently today. I'll explain more when we get down to the campground, but right now we got a two-hour drive ahead of us, so let's kick it in gear and get down there and get the camp set up. So I'll see you down there. Take care. Wow, they did it. <laughs> Folks, uh, just so you know, you can see to the right there, gravel road, not gravel road, gravel road. Now that right there to your left, that's pretty much what every road down here used to be like. Oh my goodness. Apparently this county got some funding. It says, this, this is nice. What they've done here is fantastic. Usually you can only do, you know, like anywhere from four to eight miles an hour through some of this stuff down here, so. This is just wonderful. Oh, wow. I am so grateful. All right. Cross your fingers. Let's go get that campground. Take care. Well, son of a gun. It's open. All right. Let's go pick out a site and hopefully that sun pops back out. Oh, my goodness. All right, folks. We're going in. Oh. Oh, welcome everyone to our campsite on this fall adventure uh, cheers y'all <laughs> I've already snuck a little bit sorry oh yeah oh. well appreciate y'all coming along Ooh. Got a little messy there um, very fortunate seems like we've got the campground I've been wanting to get to for whew, close to two months because due to road closures and whatnot but the roads are open got lucky ah. and as of right now um, it looks like in this entire campground there's one other camper besides myself a lot of people may not know that this campground's open but it's a gorgeous fall day oh my goodness it's a little cloudy but uh, weather wise it's fantastic a lot of the leaves have come off the trees and uh, I'm just excited. I mean, I just feel really blessed to, uh, to have this adventure this weekend. It's just lucky, I guess would be a good word for it. So appreciate y'all coming along. Y'all take care and uh, let's see where this camping adventure goes. All right, everybody, I just wanna give you a quick tour of what's right behind our campsite here. We've got little creek running through here i think that would be really nice in the evenings uh, uh, there's not enough flow that you can actually hear the water running but uh that's pretty neat and then just just woods all back through there there's uh that's the other side that's basically just an earthen dam because on the other side of that it's a lake where you can go fishing if you choose to or not <laughs> Go up there and watch the water. I may do that later. I may not. It just depends on how I feel because to get up there, uh, it's a it's a steep grade to get up there. <laughs> oh. Our picnic table for tonight. And that's this is the campground. 
the one I've been striving to get to for so long. You see, uh, someone's brought their kids down here to play on the playground. That's awesome. It doesn't look like they're camping tonight, though. And uh, <laughs> somebody is having a blast. All right, folks. Here in a bit, we're going to get a fire going and get some dinner cooking. So I'll check in with you then. Take care. All right, folks, I did make it up here after all. A little not level, but you can see from up here, there's a campsite, a little creek running through it. Might actually be able to hear the water. And I'm gonna swing around and show you the lake out here. Hopefully I don't swing this too fast. I don't know, I'm still learning this stuff. Here's our little, the, I guess earthen dam, you would call it. And here's the lake. It's a good sized lake. It's pretty. I'll give it that. Wish I could have got here sooner and get a little bit more of the fall colors than what we're seeing now. It's a little, it's a little cloudy again. Sun peaked out for a bit and then it just dove, dove right back in. So I just wanted to show you that. And I'm getting hungry. Day's getting short. So let's go get a fire going and get some dinner. Appreciate you coming along. All right, everybody. All right, I got a little base started here already. We get, uh, get our stuff out here. You're lit up and going. All right, now a friend of mine is doing some home remodeling. Great fire starter right here, let me tell you. Had some scrap two befores and asked me if I wanted any. And I said, sure. So that is an awesome fire starter. And I think I just put it out actually, accidentally. We'll see. Uh, yep, all oh, these things happen. Come around the other side here. Oh, look. Piece of paper towel. That'll work. <clears throat> so I just don't have to unstack everything. I should get going. I'll make sure once it reaches over and hits that duct tape. That's what I get. dried leaves in there. Not going to hurt anything either. There she goes. All right. Well, let's get that cooking and then we'll put a few bigger pieces on there. Matter of fact, let's just do that right now. Oh, well, that was good. Boy, I am just horrible at this today. Let me tell you. Ah, yeah, good days, bad days. There we go. All right. Check on you in a minute. Well, folks, apologies for the sun. It's setting right there, actually. And apologies again. Um, apparently, I don't know what happened. I'm I, I'm going to have to research this heavily. Uh, I thought I had figured out what the issue was with my GoPro. I thought I had a flaky battery causing me to lose things. Well, nope. So, apologies again. You missed dinner. What we did make was, well, there's what's left of it. I had made some uh, uh, pork roast the other night, so pulled pork. Had a nice sandwich, or two actually. Here's the remaining bun. And to go along with that, we had coleslaw. So it was a really good meal. <clears throat> but I don't know, this has been a real quirky trip. 
um, uh, uh, me forgetting things, being absent-minded. Uh, I don't know, just a handful of things that just don't want to quite go right. But eh, in all, I, it's okay. I don't mind so much um, because uh, to me those are just little things that oh, oh my goodness, and we got and now I'm getting overrun by gnats. Oh my goodness. <laughs> But it's just for me. It's just getting out here, um, getting away from the typical uh, eight to five grind. A uh, little bit of, I don't know, serenity, solitude, peace, and quiet. Oh my goodness, that more more so than anything. So, apologies again. Eh, these things happen. So, but I'll be upfront with you guys about it when, you know, there's a mishap or something. I'll let you know. So, you guys take care. Uh, I'm gonna clean up. <laughs> and uh, then we're going to relax by the fire so we'll see you in a few oh, guilty thing I'll stay still there we go folks this is what I was talking about earlier this, that right there this right here and this right here. Oh. My primary goal uh, for my little camping trips, and I do appreciate every one of you for coming along and watching. Um, <laughs> I have uh, I entertain myself a lot, so I'm I can laugh at myself. So uh, I just enjoy it. So we're gonna relax a little bit, and uh, I'll see you soon. Take care. All right, everybody, that was a great time, relaxing by the fire, watching the sun set over my shoulder. Wow, I mean, that's a big part of why I do this. Uh, getting out here for the peace and quiet. As eh, a quirky thing happens every now and then, something don't go quite right. But yeah, I just look ahead to my end goal, uh, relaxing and uh, really enjoying myself out here in some peace and quiet. And I really appreciate y'all coming along with me. So. Um, until the next adventure, y'all take care, and I'll see you soon.